The mayors of towns and villages near the Fukushima Daiichi plant are seeking help from the prefectural government on where to store radioactive waste. The central government wants tempor uh, to temporarily store it in their communities. We possess the ultimate weapon of control. People trust television. Tomioka town mayor Katsuya Endo met Fukushima governor Yuhei Sato on Thursday to make the request for eight towns and villages in Futaba County. It's too heavy a burden for us in Futaba County. We'd like the prefecture to act in coordination with the municipalities. He's hypnotizing the whole town through subliminal suggestions. The mayor asked the governor to set up a forum for regular meetings. He cited the problems linked to the mass evacuation that followed the nuclear accident. We are aware that we have to take the initiative in working on the issue. Governor Sato promised to set up a forum for talks. The municipalities are divided over the central government's plan for the short-term storage of radioactive waste. One of the mayors has voiced opposition, but some say they will just have to accept the plan. Attention citizens! Due to the financial irresponsibility and incompetence of your leaders, COBRA has found it necessary to restructure your nation's economy. Japan is seeking to boost the country's agriculture ahead of expected economic tie-ups with other nations. The government will earmark nearly $13 billion for the sector in the budget for fiscal year 2012 starting April. As part of the plan, the state aims to double the number of young people working in the farming industry by fiscal 2016. Under the new measure, about $20,000 a year will be offered for up to five years to people aged 25 or younger entering the sector. The government will also pay farmland owners who rent out their fallow fields. That's to raise the average acreage of farms to make them more competitive globally. The government's inconsistent policies have been a risk factor for farmers in the past. Policies need to be set without any change in stance. Now there's a man totally absorbed in his work. You've turned them into slaves. Fishmongers in Japan have promised themselves this year will be better than last year. The disaster last March hurt many in their industry. They gathered for the first auction of the new year at Tokyo's Tsukiji Market, the biggest wholesale fish market in Japan. They watched as a bluefin tuna sold for a new record high. You'll be out of business soon. <laughs> The auction kicked off around 5 a.m. The market was filled with vendors who pledged to help revive the disaster zone by selling fish from the area. A 269-kilogram tuna from Aomori Prefecture fetched the new record high, more than $740,000. The selling price was $260,000 higher than the record set last year. A Japanese sushi chain based in Tsukiji itself made the successful bid. This tuna is from Oma in Armory Prefecture and weighs 269 kilograms. Oma tuna is good. I wanted people in Japan to enjoy it. Not likely. They look like they've been zombieized. Sushi restaurants from overseas have been among the highest bidders for tuna in recent years. North Korea says its new leadership under Kim Jong-un will continue to promote nuclear development under military-led rule. Things aren't always what they seem. The statement was issued by the North's Committee for the Peaceful Reunification of the Fatherland on Thursday. The statement refers to South Korean President Im Yong Bak's New Year's speech. He said if North Korea halts its nuclear activities, the South will provide it with guaranteed safety and economic assistance through resumption of the six-party talks on the North's nuclear program. The North statement says nuclear deterrence is a revolutionary inheritance 
and that it's a foolish miscalculation to think the deterrence can be traded for some form of aid. It says that as long as hostile moves continue, the North will further strengthen its status as a nuclear-armed country to safeguard its dignity and autonomy. The Hokkaido quake was eight on the Richter scale. Everything was leveled. I don't get it. There are no active faults in that area. And Bazooka thought he heard some explosions just before the quake started. Oh, then it wasn't a natural phenomenon. It doesn't make sense. You know, Japanese scientists are trying to prevent major earthquakes by setting off precisely placed explosions. And Cobra might have figured out how to cause earthquakes with explosions. Every day, our senses are being constantly bombarded by subliminal messages that are found in TV, movies, and advertisements. The subliminal messages we are subjected to are unrecognizable by the conscious mind and only recognizable in our subconscious mind. The messages and imagery are passively absorbed and then stored in our subconscious where propagandists deliberately implant artificial thoughts which in turn can affect our actions and attitudes later in life. Experiments have shown that less than one minute after the viewer begins to watch television, the brain switches from beta level consciousness associated with active and logical thought to alpha level, which is associated with passive acceptance and suggestibility. This is why advertisers spend billions of dollars a year on commercials as well as product placement within TV shows. Political messages are implanted in fictional TV programs as the relaxed meditative state of the viewer is receptive to the programming. One example is AMC's Breaking Bad television series as it depicts a meth villain as a Ron Paul supporter. I, I, I looked him up. It's, uh, it was one of these physicists, one of Hitler's guys, a physicist named Werner Heisenberg. <laughs> Real cute, huh? In a basic college-level marketing class, in, in, in your first year of radio, television, and film, at least for me, and, and then I've seen some other textbooks and curriculum and found it's also in those, but, but, but most RTF schooling, teaches you that they have had subliminals uh, for at least 70 years in the United States and Europe. And so, yes, there is subliminal messaging everywhere. It, it is all over the place. It's an absolute fact that they flicker it.